My name is Jason Rios, and this is Old Tradition Gentlemen's Parlor in the city of Los Alamitos. Originally, I started uh, with the idea of becoming a barber, hanging out at the house, having my friends over. One day my friend, you know, just seeing this vintage chair that was there, decided to ask me like, hey, why don't you give me a haircut? And I actually had zero experience about cutting hair. So that's when I uh, sat on the idea for a couple years about like, well, what if I put myself through trade school and what if I decide to go to school and take this to the next level and actually learn how to cut hair? I decided to, uh, to branch out and, you know, open up my own shop with uh, mainly the idea of wanting to expand the idea of old traditions. I actually wanted to do a little bit more and offer more to the community, to the world, to the barber industry. So what I decided to do was to focus on a name that was gonna, throughout time, continue to preserve a lot of the old traditions within barbering. The reason why we kind of have our exposed ceilings is because we wanted to have like that old Chicago vintage Americana feel of having it be kind of like an alleyway, but it's a barber shop. So that's why we have the brick building on this side. And that's why we kind of just have this wall with our name just big across it. And we're actually located in between two uh, restaurants, which kind of gives it that very low key feel. So you kind of have to know where it's at or you have to know someone who has been there. Also, another thing that we wanted to uh, preserve and hold on to is to offer the traditional experience. And what I mean by that is to not only come into a traditional style barbershop, but live and use the traditional style uh, barber chair. So we actually are working on the vintage chair. So all of our vintage chairs go back to our oldest one being like 1890 up to our earliest, earliest one being a 1950s chair. So we try to give the full experience of the traditional style haircut, the traditional experience of the haircut and the chair, and of course the decor and ambience of it all. So the one thing that kind of sets us apart is that we try to uh, continue to preserve the razor fades. So um, you can go out there and you can find a razor fade. A lot of the times they'll do it with an uh, electric shaver or a shave box as they call it. But with us, we just try to really signature it out and we try to stick to it. So we don't use any electric razors or shave box. So if someone comes in and they request a razor fade, then we go ahead and just do it the old lather way, lather them up and just do a hot towel. And then we just go ahead and uh, shave them up. One of the things now is just to do everything with detail and with love. So what I tell you know my barbers is whether they're cleaning a chair, cleaning their station, washing their car, cleaning their room, it doesn't matter, you apply it in everyday life, but you always just give it that detail. And if you strive to kind of just go that extra mile and give everything that detail, people are always gonna notice that detail and that detail will always be paid. So if you're looking for a haircut that's gonna set you aside and you wanna keep it clean and classic, and you still want to rock it in these modern times, come see us at Old Traditions Gentlemen's Parlor and we'll go ahead and take care of you. We're located in the city of Los Alamitos. You can book us at www.otgpbarbers.com. My name's Jason Reels with Old Traditions Gentlemen's Parlor and I've just been profiled. <laughs>